We're looking at a Star Wars Battle Pack from 2014. The Imperial Troop Transport, set 75078, contains 141 pieces. Let's take a look at the build and the minifigures. This is the Imperial Transport. It's a really neat build for such a small piece count, and there's a lot of features to point out here. You have the two big cannons in the front of the ship, you have the revolving turret on top of the ship that goes a full 360 degrees, and yes, kids, those are flick fire missiles. You also have in the middle of the transport ship a bay which holds a cargo container, and the ends of the bay on each side is a single stud that's exposed, which is where you can keep your stormtrooper laser pistols when they're flying around or they're not holding them. And I have one in the stud holder just to show you an example. Here we can see the ramps folded completely down, which allows the stormtroopers to exit the transport and also the ability to get at the cargo container. This view will show them in the upward position without the stormtroopers on the transport. Quick view from the back. I do like the way they close it off. It is angular, not rounded. They do use the 2x2 two two brick down at the bottom that have the ridges, and it just adds a little something to the build. And finally, the last angle from the other side of the transport. Here's a shot of our stormtroopers carrying our cargo container. It does have handles, and it fits perfectly and allows them to transport the cargo. Now, outside the added benefit of having a cargo container, there is actual cargo. You get four extra studs that you can use in the blaster pistols that come with this battle pack. And all four extra studs can be transported inside the cargo container, and it fits perfectly. You'll see right in the middle of our transport, there are two bricks, one by four in size, that have a notch cut out in the center. That is how you transport your cargo container. You simply take the ends of the container and you slide them right inside those notches. And it fits in the center with ease. You do get four minifigure characters in this battle pack. They are all with the same print, all with the same face, all with the same helmet, and all of them get a blaster pistol. Now, if you're not familiar with these new blaster pistols from 2014, what LEGO did is they had designed them to take a one-by-one -one circular stud and they stick it in the front end of the blaster pistol. Now I'll bring one up close so you can see. There is a little gray piece that snaps in on the top and that acts as the deployment of the stud. You simply press it down and the stud shoots out. Back to our minifigures, as I had mentioned, all of the torso printing on the front and the back are completely identical. The two on the left, I have one with the helmet removed and one with the helmet added facing front. The two on the right, I have one with the helmet removed and they're both facing the rear. So you can get a good shot of all the printing across all the minifigures. Typical clone face, we've seen that many times before. Flesh skin, no alternate face. I do like the designs on the helmet. They resemble our older style stormtroopers not so much the Force Awakens Stormtroopers. So if you've seen the advertisements or trailers for the movie, you'll notice that the design of the helmet is just a little bit different. This is a perfect Stormtrooper for anybody that is trying to grow a Stormtrooper army. These sets are still available today, so I highly recommend if you're going to build a Stormtrooper army, this is a great pack to get. Now having the pistols inside the stud holder within the transport also is a great way to keep the cargo piece in place. That's our quick little review of this Star Wars Battle Pack. We hoped you enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up if you did. Please don't forget to check out our other videos and our social media sites, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Google+. If you would like to receive more alerts when we have new information, click that subscribe button. Thanks for stopping by, and until the next video, Happy building.